Tracy, where, where do you begin analyzing these documents? Well, the first thing that I'd like to do is look at the financial statements and the tax returns again to get a history of what the financials look like. I'm, I'm wanting to know what are the assets of the business? Has income been going up or down? How has the company possibly been affected by the economy or certain market conditions? How have expenses been changing over time? Are there suspicious changes in expenses? Has there been a change in ownership? For example, a divorce that I recently worked on. Um, the owner of the company, the husband, uh, quietly transferred his ownership interest in the company to a trust, potentially thinking that there was a divorce on the horizon and that maybe by transferring that interest to a trust, it would no longer be available for his soon-to-be ex-spouse. So some of this stuff shows up in the financial statements. Um, I might also look for how are the owners being compensated and has that changed over time? Are there certain perks or other benefits in the business that are changing? So there's a whole lot of financial information that can be provided just with the financial statements and the tax returns.